quite important is that the hospice often gets and looks often gets viewed as just a, an inpatient centre, but actually the inpatient centre is just a single part of the care that we deliver at the hospice uh, at St Luke's. Really what we're trying to deliver is, is um, care that enables people to be independent um, at difficult times and remain at home for as long as possible and really try and add quality to, to their lives as they stay at home. We have our own community team which is a bunch of nurses that will go out to care for patients in the community in their own home. Patients don't always want to come into the hospice, they want to spend whatever time they have got left at home in the home environment with their family. Without the community team we wouldn't be able to provide that service. I think the one consistent thing that everybody agrees on is, Plana, this is not what I expected it to be. This is just not what you think that you're going to get when you walk in. It, it, you know, it surpasses, I think, nearly everybody's expectations that I've come across. It's, uh, it's, not, it's not very often you come across a place like St Luke's. It, it is one of the most important places uh, there can be in, in Sheffield. I think it's brought us a little bit closer. Um, I think it's because you try and make a bit more effort because you know you're not going to have long together. And um, which is, um, which is a bit sad. I think if there, if there were words I could use to sum up St Luke, it would be respect and dignity. They respect you and your feelings and your needs. And the one thing they respect is your dignity. It's not just for the patient. For me, it's been more for the families. It's the support that the families get. Sheffield would be a poorer, poorer place without it, not just because it's a hospice, but because of what St Luke's has made itself into, because of the staff, because of the dedication, because of the environment, everything about the place. In order to run St Luke's, um, we need over £7 million pounds a year. Um, and we actually need to fundraise over £4.9 million pounds each year, which equates to about £13,500 a day, um, which we raise through the support of our um, supporters, through events, through families and carers who support us. Without that, we'd be closed in, in six months. I think once you've been touched by St Luke's, you understand why they need every penny. I don't know where, what my life would be like if I'd never come to St Luke's. I don't know how it would have been, you know, how my medication would have been. I, it just, well, I, I can't believe I could manage without it, really. The place is not about dying, it's about living and it's about enjoying, enjoying your time and enjoying, en enjoying your life. I can never thank St Luke's enough for the support that they've given me, all of them, every member of staff here. Mm -hmm.